Oh, Greg. Okay, if I just need more time. More. No. No. I'm here, Sam. Hey, don't move, okay? Don't move. Sam, no. Mission, we have to help him. You're too weak. Let me up. Just stay down, Sam. I need to help him. Go back to sleep, Sam. But... You need rest. Sam. I know John can make a strong first impression, but he's what's keeping this entire family from being buried out there. You gotta fight like hell for what you care about, right? Something that makes all this shit worth it. You try to protect everyone, you end up protecting no one. Better than not trying at all. You'd be crazy to stay here, John. This woman normally Enough. will... There's no decision to be made on this. I need a word with you. In private. Do you have children? A son? A daughter? I do. Two little girls. Know the day my wife died. Her heart gave out. Sam found her. She... She passed in her sleep. We buried her so the boys wouldn't have to see her like that. The snow... It covered her grave. We erased it. Like she'd never been there at all. I'm really sorry for your loss. Thank you. I've tried to focus on our kids, but the past, it always seems to find you. Ever since Sophia, I've tried to keep our family from harm, but we're falling apart, piece by piece. And now that Sam's hurt, and Greg's, I could really use your help. Your friend Pete told me all about Norma, about what happened. If she finds us, we wouldn't stand a chance. But you seem like someone who can hold their own. You've got a good thing going here. Safe house, nice family. It's more rare than you know. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Children shouldn't have to see this. Greg never turned into one of these things, did he? Are those... whatever they are. He's at peace now. <gasps> Thank God. I... 
I'm sorry. I'm trying to keep it together. But what if you just found out your daughters were dead? And you weren't there. You were miles away, safe and sound. How would you feel? Your kids need you to stay strong. You, you're right. I'm all they have. Peekaboo. Dead yet. Uh, uh, you? yourself a golden goose. If you think I'm shitting any eggs, forget it. I'm asking the questions here. Say now, won't this be fun? That's up to you. Does Norma know we're here? She doesn't even know I'm here. 
Otherwise, you'd be hearing a neighborly knock on your door right about now. Randall? Randall, are you getting this? You, uh, want to get that for me? We heard gunshots. If you don't check in, I'm sending everyone in that direction. Shit. She sounds pissed. Randall, pick up, goddammit. You gonna answer? Talk to her, Michonne. Don't make the same mistake again. Where the hell are you? Yeah! Randall! Yeah. I got a few words for her. Hello, Norma. Michelle. Where's my brother? Go on. Tell her. Don't spare any of the gory details. You're talking to me, not him. Don't be smart with me, Michelle. That wasn't what I asked. I want the truth on this. You hear me? Did you hurt him? so much as breathed on my brother, I'll find you and make what happened on the ferry look like a goddamn picnic! That's a fucking guarantee! He's fine. Haven't touched him. Good girl. Okay, 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 okay. Let's wind this down, then. If you've had his walkie-talkie the whole time, then you already know. We heard the shots. We know where you are. But if you let Randall go, maybe we can all walk away. Randall is the only family I have, and I'm not leaving him behind. One way or the other. No way in hell I'm giving your brother back. Not after all the shit he's done. This little game you're playing, I don't fucking like it. We'll be there soon. This alone time, you and me together, it's been real nice. But that all ends when my sister gets here. I'm gonna take that wrench and break your skull. And then Sam's and yours. And last but not least, those kitties too. I saw their little heads in the window. Kids, you know, their skulls don't break so much as kind of melt. Guess I hit a button. Michonne. Don't you two look like your daddy? Back when he still had a face. <laughs> what? Yeah. Got a big hole there now. Sean? Is that true? Please tell me he's fucking with us. Please. Randall murdered your dad, Sam. Jones just been fumbled around like a bear cub fucking a football. Randall has more value if he's alive. Gives us something to bargain with when Norma gets Listen here. Listen to me. That won't work. They only bargain with bullets. All she wants is her brother back. That's it. We're out of the equation. You need to kill him, or I will. Sam, wait! No matter what I say, you're just gonna do whatever you want anyway. I know you've already made up your mind. Well, <laughs> I ain't had the bail of the ball. Well, maybe that's you. Because when this dance is over, you're fucked. Kill me, and Norma hunts you down until you're all dead. Fucked! Let me live, and I do even worse. 
fucked. But we both know how this is gonna end, Michonne. You like killing. Then you'd like killing me, wouldn't you? Just tell old Randall the truth. I got thick skin. You're wrong, Randall. Am I? Well, maybe. Maybe you think you can rise above all that. But there ain't no heaven up there, honey. And there ain't no hell down below. There's only this shit every day until you die. Then you know what's the fucking kicker? You get up and keep walking. It's how it is now. Nothing we can do to change it. Preaching in the fucking choir. This is the world your kids are dying in, Michelle. <gasps> or dying in. Or are in that walking purgatory. Shut up. Don't talk about that. Either way, they're suffering. And mommy isn't. We all have our demons, honey. Some are on the inside. Guess that means the dance is over. Oh, well, no one will be here soon. Your funeral. I spent a lot of time in low, low places. Where you only have your thoughts for company. And those can be mean, nasty. You want to believe all lives and all deaths have purpose. <laughs> believe me, they don't. It's true. Things always fall apart. But we're the ones who bring them down. 